<clears throat> What's up you guys, Idiot Fliptronics. So I'm gonna give you guys my top recommendation for the best smartphone for stock trading. So before any of this, you guys, I'd appreciate if you hit that uh, like and share button below, and then if you haven't subscribed to us, please hit that subscribe too. Um, I am still using this Yoshi wallpaper, you guys. I got it from Pinterest. He's rocking some headphones. Uh, it's really cool, so a lot of people have been asking me where I got it. Okay, anyways, you guys. Um, 95% of viruses are happening on Android phones, so I recommend you stay away from an Android phone if you're looking to, uh, you know, trade stocks, whether it be, you know, daily, weekly, monthly, whatever, okay? So, um, you know, I've been using the iPhone 7, so I mean, if you guys have the money to, uh, you know, grab the 7 or 7 Plus, I totally recommend you just do it. Um, if you don't, you know, try to get, you know, like a 6S or something cheaper, but, you know, if you're due for an upgrade and you have the money, I'd recommend going straight to the 7 or 7 Plus. They're much faster, um, and, you know, overall performance is going to be better, plus battery life is definitely better, too. So if you guys can afford it, go for it. If not, you know, whatever. But like I said, you guys, 95% of viruses are happening on Android phones, so, you know, that's mainly because... You know, iOS is constantly being updated all the time, so, uh, you know, this helps with any kind of, like, security risks on your phone. Now that I've talked about iOS, you guys, and recommending, a, you know, grabbing an iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, I do want to talk about a stock trading app that is freaking awesome. It's called Robinhood. So, uh, there are some downsides to this, app, to this app, but there are also some, you know, strong positives. Okay, so I've got it pulled up here in the App Store. Basically, you guys, Robinhood... Um, allows you to trade stocks for free. So normally when you guys place a trade to buy stock on a brokerage, like any, pretty much anyone, they'll charge you, you know, around 10 bucks to buy stock and then $10 to sell it. What's really cool about Robinhood, which I'm about to open up, is that it's completely free, you know, to buy, uh, buy stock and then sell stock. So there's no fees. Um, that's why it's so popular. I have no idea how they make money, you guys. It's kind of crazy. Um, honestly, I'm going to show you guys how to use it. Uh, it's pretty simple, but let's just see, uh, looks like Facebook's right here. So anyways, I'm just going to pull up, um, you know, a stock and show you guys how easy it is. It's also like so easy to create an account on here. It takes a few minutes. I'll leave a link in the description for Robinhood as well. But anyways, you can pull up up to a five year chart. Um, and then you can hold down on the chart to kind of move it over. You, you guys can kind of see that. So you can look at the history a little bit. Um, it's not very analytical, so you're not going to be able to like really look at it. But, um, you know, it gets the job done. Plus, this is in real time. So this is the stock price in real time. Now, let's say, for example, you want to go buy some stock of Facebook. Um, let's say I want to buy five shares for $734. All you have to do is click review, place trade, and it'll do it right away. I mean, it's literally that easy, you guys. There are no charges. You guys saw the real-time movement right there. There's no charges to use this, you guys. Um, the only downside to this uh, app, you guys, is that it's not very analytical, um, but... You know, like I said, it gets the job done. Plus, if you're looking to save money and who isn't, this app is, you know, your best bet. It's also available on Android, you guys, but, you know, we're talking about the best smartphone for stock trading. Like I said, I just recommend grabbing an iPhone for sure. So, anyways, you guys, uh, totally hope that uh, helps you guys out. Hope you guys are loving the Yoshi wallpaper. You know, I've kind of kept it on here for a while. Like I said, I'd appreciate a like and a share, you guys. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't, and I'll leave links in the description for Robinhood and, you know, the 7 and 7 Plus if you guys are in the market for a new phone. So thanks for watching, you guys, and we will see you all later.